The next slide is a uh, section of deer tongue uh, that uh, contains numerous sarcocystis uh, zotocysts. Uh, uh, and in the case of uh, sarcocystis, these uh, cysts are, are known as uh, sarcosis or, um, more commonly. Uh, if you start along the edge of, uh, of this section, uh, you'll, you'll be able to find uh, the layers of the skin and then down in the underneath the layers of the skin you should find uh, muscle cells and they are very pink some of them are in cross section like here um, and others are in in uh, longitudinal section as, as in this uh, at the end of the pointer there's some more cross sections and uh, all you need to do is to look around uh, within the muscle tissues and you will find uh, these sarcosis. They will appear uh, to be rather purple uh, in, and it contrasts nicely with the, um, the pink muscles and you can find these um, even at uh, 4x magnification. With the 40x objective um, it's quite easy to see the, the cysts and uh, one thing I want you to notice is the fact that they are living uh, inside the muscle cell. Uh, and if, if you look all the way around the rim of this cyst, you can see that muscle cell. Um, and then the developmental stages, if you remember, uh, are present inside that cyst. And they can then rupture out. Uh, the canine then will become infected with sarcocystis through the ingestion of those cysts and, and the consumption of the developmental stages.